Hey, yo, how's it going, boys? What is up? Source back once again for yet another character impressions. This time we have Caro, another win character in the banner. I think he's part of the event as well, but uh, I didn't read the event, so I wouldn't know. But on the other hand, let's uh, not look at this screen because I have him. <laughs> All right. We can uh, do something about this guy. All right. Anyways, so Caro has... Uh, I do not know how to pronounce that. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not. I'm not even gonna try. Messi win damage to a foe and cooldown to four tribuna. Uh, okay. The first skill is Maesta. Maesta win uh, effect to win allies. Cut this skill's cooldown based on the number of hub specialty allies in party. Great. Not again. <laughs> What's this? Debuff resistance boosted. Excuse me. Charge bar. Boosted every turn. Wait, so that's uplift. Elemental damage from full turn into earth damage. So that's a uh, earth switch. Uh, earth damage taken is uh, lowered. Cool. So it ends upon taking damage two times. Oh, is that kind of character? Tribuna is a uh, wind damage and hit to attack and defense to all foes based on the foes tune level upon cast. Max is 6 hits, raise tomb level by 1. This sounds like Manomel kind of character. Yeah, looks like another full auto Ogi kind of guy too. N Nessun Dorma. Bonus superior elemental damage effect to win allies. When foe's tune level is 7 or above, sharp boost to attack 1 hit. So assassin, 1 hit only assassin. When 10 or above, and cast from 10th turn onwards, attack twice each turn. So is this the reason why Nagic was hinting this shit to me about Siegfried, using him in Siegfried? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> he was hinting, hinting because I, I showed this to the crew earlier, he was hinting me to use this character for Siegfried or some shit. Because I've been starting to do, I'm starting to do Siegfried raids again, <laughs> just so I can farm sense. <laughs> but, hmm. He definitely looks somewhat doable, but... I don't know about that though. Uh, lover of arts, protector of the people. Gain effects in order of uh, in order based on number of hub specialty allies in party. Boost to attack, boost to defense, triple attack, boost to dodge rate and charge bar gain. I mean, I guess he's he's a good friend to uh, Kentate or something. Try uh. Timber of hope boost to hub specialty allies attack and damage card based on foe's tune level. Oh, that's useful though. That's actually a good passive. Debuff resistance up 100%, so you're immune to debuffs. 10% uplift, and then earth switch, and then 50% earth damage lowered. So uh, it goes up to six turn cut, skill cooldown. If you have all six members as harps. So right now it's 14 turns, because I already leveled, okay, yeah. I already leveled his ass, so it's 14 turns, so you can get up to 6. Oh my god, that sounds ass though. And then, uh, Tribuna is the, the, the spammable Ogi shit, right? Base cap for this is 405,000. This too is 5% per stack, up to 40%. So you get 6 hits, yeah. If He can nuke a lot though, if you get this, sh this tuning shit up ASAP. And then this one is... 20% echo. Uh, excessive multiplier is 50%, so it's, that's quite normal. And then this one is... Yes, 30% perpetuity uh, mod attack. 100% defense, wow. Guaranteed triple boost dodge rate. Wait, what's his dodge rate? 20% charge bar gain. They never mentioned yet. Even Game Week doesn't have it. We do not know how much dodge he has. If I were to make a wild guess, it's maybe 15%. And then uh, the last one is... Oh, that's an attack. That's a normal mod. Yeah, that's a normal mod. Hmm. Maybe not as good as I thought anymore. The attack is 3% per stack, up to 30%. Then damage cap is 1% per stack, all the way to 10%. Wait, what's his weapon? <laughs> I didn't check his weapon yet. Trash. Alright, good to know. <laughs> Alright, what is this? Wow. That is depressing. 
Jesus, that's actually depressing. <laughs> hmm. That that EMP is depressing. You probably want his wind attack, obviously. Wind attack, CA damage, maybe. And then uh get some attack is okay. Attack. I don't think you really need defense that much because he already has 10 hundred percent defense. So maybe put in some attack or you could also put in like a I'm actually thinking that you can actually you can just put up hostility as well because maybe his dodge might be actually OP. Then he can just abuse that hostility, or you could just put Earth Defend uh, damage down too because you know he has Earth Switch right. So most likely he's gonna get Earth damage anyway. So it's all right. Uh, I I should probably get skill cap on him. Oh, skill cap. Mm. <laughs> Alright, we'll be here for a while, boys. Alright, that'll do. 7% is ass, but that'll do. <laughs> I am too lazy to sit here too long. <laughs> I do not want to burn my Ra and Anima. No thanks. Alright, so I have 4, right? I guess 4 is fine because I can get the dodge, right? Yeah, I can get the dodge. And tuning isn't that slow, right? Yeah, I don't think it's that slow because we are CT in there and we are Ogi, dude, Ogi, oh shit! Man, I don't multi-hit, so technically I don't even need the... Wait, I am multi-hitting, right? Yeah, never mind. I forgot we go up to six hits <laughs> with this guy. Yeah, so that's fine. Let's Ogi! Ogi! You guys uh, loving the Ogi chat? I heckin' love my Ogi. So I only I need to use this only at 10 tuning and above, right? Yeah. Okay, I forgot to turn that off. You took I mean, his, his, his Ogi animation is not bad, I suppose. <laughs> Ouch. Hmm, already 4 mil, 4.6 mil, not bad. Yeah, it's very slow though, that's alright. Because uh, I'm never gonna use him after this. <laughs> And plus we have uplift as well, man, I'm gonna Ogi a lot. Alright, four stacks of Ogi, man. I can love the Ogi, damn, I actually almost reset, uh, refreshed as well. Miss. 20 mil damage. Technically, I can just use that in turn one, but oh well. Charge attack four times. Oh no, dude. 
Charge attack four times. Yeah, let's Baha cause why not, right? That's very loud. <laughs> I heard you like Ogi chat. Look at that Ogi man. Oh my god, the lockout is amazing. <laughs> Yeah, his damage is not bad though. Even without Bahakon and his other standard shit, his, his damage is not bad. 13 million already, holy shit. With the 3 stacks man, shit dude. I'm only at 7, I'm at turn 9 already and my tuning is still turn, uh, what's that, at 7 Holy hell man, it's slow <laughs> Even with the Ogi Neo S4, yeah that's what I'm trying to do, yes It's so slow! <laughs> okay, now I have uh, 8 Yeah, but whatever, I guess. Alright, five stacks though. Okay, nine stacks. Okay, next turn, boys. Next turn, you ready? Time for the big shit. Next turn. Next turn, we're gonna do no damage at all because I do not have a lot of echo and shit. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna turn this off. We're gonna press this first. Actually, no, I can babu first, but... <laughs> Alright, we are 10. We're gonna babu. We're gonna press this, we're gonna press this. And let's let it MC triple triple strike, why not? I think he's dead. <laughs> I can't even hit everything. <laughs> I couldn't even hear anything yet, it doesn't have enough HP dude. 16% <laughs> is too little. <laughs> I think the easiest for me to for me to do it, you know how? <laughs> Oops, fucking trial. But tr dude, the amount I don't yeah. Just for actual numbers, right? Not elite numbers, right? Even with the trial shit, he is hitting pretty hard though. That's seven stacks already. Uh, eight stacks were uh, yeah, I mean he's already max stacks right now. Nine million is pretty good. Yeah, 9 million new is pretty good. Okay, now we can do this again. Bam. Okay. So, bam. I'll just press that too, why not? Bam, bam. Bam. Press this. There. That was 100 mil. <laughs> that's 113 mil. Alright, that's not bad I guess, but it takes fucking long to get there though. Alright, let's go let's go back to the uh battle log for this guy. Damn. Almost on par we see it. Damn, must be strong, right? God damn, brother. Actually OP, man. Almost as strong as a Juten, dude. Wait, if you think about it, he's actually doing more. Wait, no, no, no. He actually does more than Siete. 
Yeah. Because remember how Neo and uh his his turn doesn't get countered because he uh Banu died already with the assassin shit? Because Sieti attacked. That's why he has this amount. Yeah. So technically this guy does more. <laughs> like way more. <laughs> Yeah, if you think about it, he's actually supposed to do at least 10 million, 10 plus million more compared to CAT. So end of the day, once again, um, I think Carol has the same issue as, uh, what was the girl's name earlier? Kentate, yeah. It has the same issue, like in terms of uh, building the character, I feel like he's very limited in that regard. Once again, because it's very reliant on harp specialty characters and not to mention uh, if you really want to like really really make use of him you need to get the tuning up ASAP and not to mention you have to Ogi a lot too so uh, that's fun very very slow character you can technically use him in full auto kind of stuff you can put in like other if you really want to make use of him sure put in other harp characters you want to make it go faster and shit but to me I don't think I'm ever going to use him because it's just way too damn slow. It's too damn slow compared to other limited characters. I mean, to be fair, to be fair, he is a supplicable character. So for a supplicable character to actually able to hit that hard is uh, not so bad. The only problem is that I feel like in order for you to really fully utilize him, right? At, not really fully utilize him, at least utilize him enough to really make do with his damage it's like i think you need at least i don't know tuning level six or something right because it's based on how many tune levels right and max six hits or something so maybe no i think around five hits five tuning right level five tuning or something in order for you to cap that shit so it, it still does take you a while to get that even then yeah because if it's just him alone he's only you can only do it with his s2 you can only get tuning with his S2 and then you Ogi, you get it again. So it's he's very reliant on Ogi. <laughs> if he's you're only using him alone. If you're using like maybe Selfira and uh, Kentate together with him, you can get that a lot faster. Yes. So if you're going the whole Kango Ting Majin kind of stuff, you probably want to have Kan Kentate with him. Just so you can get the stuff up for her and him uh, a lot faster. You're not, if not, you're just gonna be like me earlier. It just take fucking forever to get it uh, up and running. So that kind of sucks. Yeah. I'm not entirely certain like how much his dodge was. I guess it's... I mean, after trying him out, it does look like his dodge is definitely higher than 15%. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe 30, 45% or something around there. Maybe 30%. It seems kind of higher than 15% <laughs> from that the guess I did earlier. But uh, other than that... Yeah, he's alright. He's pretty cool for a subtitable character, but uh, end of the day, it really just depends whether you want to have fun or not. If not, then you can just forget about him and move on to a much better uh, win character or something. Yep. So um, that's all I'm going to say about uh, Mr. Caro. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys on the next one, which is tomorrow because uh, we are already in May. So we get uh, Korega tomorrow. Yay!